Hi everyone, with Christmas approaching fast, today I wanted to talk to you about how to stay stress-free during the whole Christmas period so you can enjoy yourself. The main thing that I've found that helps me with this time of the year in not getting flustered is planning and pacing myself. So for example, when it comes to gifts, I make a list of who I want to buy a gift for and what I want to get them. And this also is a really good tip to help you not overspend as well. I unfortunately caught one of the nasty colds that was going around a couple of weeks ago and as soon as I felt slightly better I decided to hit the shops and try get a load of my Christmas shopping done which wasn't the best idea because I still felt quite rubbish from the cold and I definitely overdid it so this is really where pacing yourself comes in. It's much better to break down the list of to-dos that you've got to do. So for example, when you're shopping, whether that's buying food or gifts, do a little bit at a time. It doesn't all have to be done in one day. If you break down what needs to be bought for different days so that you can rest in between, it will definitely help you to not burn out. This time of the year is always filled with loads of events, whether that's family get-togethers, work Christmas parties, or just seeing your friends for some food or a drink. It always feels like there's something, and I know that this can be quite daunting. The trick to managing this is to really listen to your body and to know if you're overdoing yourself. I know from personal experience it can be so easy to just push yourself so that you can keep up and do everything, but in the long run all you're doing is making yourself feel worse, and you know, you don't wanna end up then being ill for Christmas day. Rest in between all of the events where you can, and if you feel up to it, great, then go, but if you don't, it's really important to remember to not be so hard on yourself if you can't manage something. If you haven't already, start planning now for Christmas day, whether that be the food that you need to cook or presents that you need to wrap and give out, the more that you can plan and prepare ahead of the day, the less work that needs to be done on the actual day and the more time you'll have just to relax. We all know that stress can have such an impact on MS and the last thing we want over this festive period is for that to play an effect on our time with friends and family. So take it easy this year, rest where you can and enjoy as much as you can and have a great Christmas everyone.